Hey guys, so we are covering the 2.5 update. We got some exciting changes, some fresh content. So let's dive into what this update brings. So first of all, the community challenge, we got the boom box is unlocked for everybody. And you know, the special shout out to Goo and Sledge here for doing the most astonishing 185 kilometers. And then the second part of this also is the Embark ID and how it's changed. I think if you've not already done it, you can visit the Embark portal to update yours if needed but everyone's using now the Embark ID. So let's dive into some balancing changes. We have the data reshaper. Uh, its range has increased from five to 15 meters, which I think is a, is a good change. And then they changed the FOV on it. They decreased it from 25 to 12 degrees due to the extension of that range. So it's not wildly affecting a, a massive area, I think. And then the stun gun and cloaking device are going to have changes that come more so in the 2.6 update. They've made some tweaks. They've made a major tweak for the cloaking device now. The stun gun is coming. The cloaking device by change, massive changes, it, it's mostly the, the cost when activating the cloaking device. So it has doubled, has more than doubled to activate the cloaking device. But the duration, if you have a full charge the duration doesn't change it's just that activation cost so if you keep deactivating and activating your cloak you will actually lower that duration so it's to i think more so prevent players from cloaking uncloaking really quickly and then we got some weapon tweaks we got the ks23 this change mostly just like a bullet dispersion change for when pretty much moving around and making the weapon more accurate. So it's from a standing point, the recoil hasn't changed anything like that, but when moving, jumping and things like that, they've just made it a little bit more accurate. And then I think the biggest change for this 2.5 update that I'm the most excited about is the security changes, detection for mechanisms now to identify software, such as cheat tools, injections, and leading to suspensions for these, you know, these rule violations. So I think the finals has something similar in my opinion something to tarkov where one you don't have a kill cam and so and this is a free to play game i think there's a a wider chance for players to just create a new steam account and cheat now i think this 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 change here i think will one help alleviate that for sure and then so so you know that that covers the 2.5 update get ready to adapt your strategies explore some of those new balances and i'm ready to catch you guys out in the finals